had what I hope is a very exciting letter come through. So as you know, we booked our holiday. Oh, it is. So we booked our holiday, but I didn't actually have a passport yet. I'd sent it off, but obviously there's loads of different things I have to go through before it comes. But, yay! <laughs> My passport come! I'm very excited. My photo is... We just won't even talk about my photo. So I'm looking a bit more presentable than I did this morning. I've just shown my hair up. I've seen someone have hair like this the other day and it looked really nice, but I feel like I'm just giving off chav. <laughs> Today, I'm just waiting for Becky to finish work. We go Aldi because we do a food shop, but I'm really gonna try eat healthy from now on because I've booked my holiday and we're also going Cornwall in May. This body can't, <laughs> it's not bikini ready. Also, I sliced my finger on a veg peeler yesterday at work and it sliced it in two different parts on the tip of my finger there the tip of my finger there and then there's another one like somewhere else but this plastic probably should go in the bin now but like it's dead hard because when i stick it to my biab it like sticks to the biab and it really hurts <laughs> it doesn't hurt it just feels weird and then i'm not sure if we're going anywhere else i need to go to my mum's because my tiktok coat finally come didn't actually take that long i think it took like two weeks hats are starving do you know what i'm on about my mood are you hungry are you hungry? Are you? in Aldi. I'll do a, like a little mini haul when I get back and the things of all. We haven't done a massive one this week because I just ignore the line but we haven't done a massive one this week just because we've got loads of freezer stuff in already so we literally just have to and we're working for three days this week and then going out for food on Saturday I think for my birthday so but we are just we've just bought for this week so I'll show you what we've got when I get back. Becky's just putting the stuff away. I literally look so bold. But looking like this is why people get cars with white seats because I literally it blends in. So I'm gonna go home now. There's so much traffic getting off this car park, so I'm really just not looking forward to that, to be honest. But I will show you what we get, what we got properly when I get home. We're having like a homemade Nando's tonight, so we bought some peri peri salt and a peri peri garlic rub, which this is too spicy for me, but we're just gonna put a little bit on. But yeah, everything else that I got was just like um, the basics that we always buy, like fruit, veg, chicken, stuff like that. We're just gonna chill now. I'm gonna watch some TV. So I will show you when we're making the Nando's. I really hope it tastes that nice. Obviously, it'll never beat the real Nando's ever. Hopefully, it'll taste somewhat nice. This is what we're using to do our Nando's chicken with. We usually have like the, the ones in the bag, but we thought this would just be quite easy. Just pour on there, rub the chicken on. If you don't like raw chicken, then apologies. <laughs> chips we're going to be using these crispy skin ones which we have these all the time anyway but i feel like they're like the closest to what nando's do mm -hmm. ended up looking like we've got the wrap chips garlic bread broccoli that's becky's and of course the best sauce ever let's try the wrap because we didn't really work out i'm trying to cut it like nando's got it i've been falling out there's a wrap it doesn't quite equivalent to a nando's but what would go eat there and watch emily in paris okay so you know how bald i look i need to chuck a claw clip in my hair but so it's the next day i didn't even close the vlog off last night to be honest because we literally just chilled played Fortnite and went to bed so we're babysitting harlow today which is my best friend's baby we're going to go see our new cat soon which i'm very excited about we've been waiting since she was like a baby but we can't have her yet because she's still not 100 percent feeding off like cat food she's still relying on the mom so we're not having her today but we're seeing her for the first time which is very exciting so i thought i'd do a quick outfit of the day because i've got my new tiktok coat on ignore any mess i really need to tidy up but i've just got on this brown jumper from primal black leggings i'm gonna wear some cream shoes and then this is the coat 
you can't see it, let me put you down a bit. This is the code, it's so nice. It's still very creased, so I think I need to either like iron it or get some crease release on it, but yeah, it's definitely puffed up more. When I first stitched out the package, it was really thin. So let's just ignore the absolute state that I look right now. It's currently nine o'clock and I'm only just picking up the camera from literally this morning because we've had Harlow all day. So I've literally just not vlogged anything because I just don't really want to put them on the camera. Plus like everyone knows that looking after a baby is quite hectic. So the last thing I even thought about was picking up the camera. We've literally just chilled all day. We went to see Marley, my new cat earlier. I'll insert pictures here. She's so cute, but She's like seven weeks now and, she, and she's still not eating cat food so that's a bit worrying because the woman like says we can have her from next week but obviously if she's still feeding off her mum then is that the best decision? I'm not sure. I feel like we'll just have to see how she is next week because we've still got a week for her to start eating cat food and stuff but she might just not like the cat food that that woman's giving her so I'm not sure what we're going to do. Yeah, she's so cute and she was, very, she was really shy at first. There was another one, a little black one, who literally just comes straight up to people and was like, so energetic and this one was really shy but she'll fit in very well in this family because my other two cats are very shy as well but yeah she was really cute and i can't wait to get it she's so small like, pictures don't even do just how tiny she is like she could literally fit in my hand she kept crawling up even just sitting on my shoulder like a parrot she was so cute but i'm just gonna go have a shower now and then go to bed because i've got work tomorrow for the next three days which i'm just not looking forward to because i'm just so tired i'm gonna go have a shower now because i like being in bed by 10 and it's already five past nine I'm not sure if i'll vlog the next three days just because i've said before i literally start work at quarter to eight in the morning and don't finish till eight at night so it's there's nothing to film like the morning i literally just get up as late as possible get ready as quick as possible and then go to work and then when i come home it's just kind of the same routine of have a shower go to bed so but it is my birthday on saturday and we're going out so that'll more than likely be the next clip in this vlog is me going out and getting drunk so I will see you either tomorrow or on Saturday. I haven't vlogged for the past few days because I've literally just been at work for 12 hours. Like I think I said, but today it's my birthday. And I feel so old, like I'm 24 this birthday and it just, it's quite scary actually. But Becky got me the, the famous Sisters and Seekers yoga hoodie for my birthday and I'm so excited. I've literally wanted it for so long. Right now my parents are just coming around just to see me on my birthday and then me, Chelsea and Becky, are going shopping because as per usual i've left it last minute to go find an outfit for tonight so everything crossed that i actually find something i like i can't be picky because i've got no other option hello my hair isn't greasy either i've got a hair mask in let's go i'll show you my card that becky got me as well it's downstairs it's so cute just a quick outfit of the day ignore how messy the bed is we need to tidy up but i just got on um, my yoga hoodie this TikTok shop coat, grey leggings and Becky's Oswego's. Might take the coat off though because I'll probably be way too hot when I'm going shopping. But yeah, that's my outfit. So this is the card that I've got off Becky. How cute is that? So I've got our new cat, which we're getting hopefully next week. Maple, which rest in peace, Maple. Miss you load. Our babies and then me and Becky. That's just the best card I've ever had in my life. I've just got all my favourite people and things on. I thought I'd just quickly show you what I got from shopping wasn't a very successful shopping trip i think that's a bit of lighting it wasn't a very successful shopping trip because i didn't find a top that i liked and i didn't find any shoes which is like the main thing that i needed really but i did get a skirt it was on sale for seven pound actually it's just like a blue is it corduroy co cord i don't even know what it's actually called but it's just like a mini skirt and then it's got this cute little buckle and it was literally on sale for seven pound maybe 40 and it actually looked really cute on so i got that i just got some little hoop earrings because i've i've got hoops but primark ones just go like crap so i just got some more these were 250 and i like like three in one primark i've bought back their like ribbed sportswear so i picked up some black ones i've got pink and blue shorts like these from last year but i didn't actually have any black ones and these are only four pounds so i got them i love these they're literally they're so stretchy and they're just so comfy and then i got a bag and if this isn't giving jacquemus vibes then i don't know what is it obviously comes with like the long black strap but i'll probably just have it as a shoulder bag and i love that i think it's so cute it's got like, this cross detailing it was how much was this and it was only nine pound nine pound compared to like the jacquemus one big difference that's my outfit for tonight i think i'm just gonna wear a plain black long top and then shoes i have absolutely no idea we've ordered a mackies as you can see becky right there with it um, we didn't order we went 
smackies on the way home. So we're gonna eat this and then I'm gonna wash my hair, mask out. And then I'm very tempted to like run to another shop to try and find some shoes because I just really don't know what shoes I'm gonna wear with my outfit, nothing will go. I just got back from a very stressful shopping trip because I didn't have any shoes to wear that would go with my outfit at all. So I went up to like another retail park and they had nothing. So, but I ended up buying a pair of shoes, which I don't really like that much, but I was just so desperate that I just needed something. And that's gonna be all my hair and also the fact that I have an hour to get ready which is just great, definitely it isn't gonna happen. But I met my sister up there and she gave me her, well, the present off both my sisters, but I only saw one of them. How cute are these little balloons on top? She always goes all out with the wrapping. God knows how I'm gonna actually undo all this, so, so thanks, Charles. <laughs> and also, my niece Millie, she got me, well, she wrote me a card out for my birthday last year, but they never actually gave it me, so I've got two cards off Millie. <laughs> one off my sister, I'll open them in a minute. And then I got my present. I actually know what this is because I accidentally saw it in my sister's wardrobe. Yay! Oh my god! I'm so excited. I didn't even see what it was. It's the Mark Hill Pick and Mix Party Pack. So I, I've wanted the Pick and Mix like range from Mark Hill for so long because like you buy like the the handle and then you can buy like all different like head tool things for the handle. But this one come with four different ones. So it comes with a medium barrel an easy tongue whatever that is an ombre textured waver and a corkscrew barrel so you've literally got four different curlers there in like a pack and i just think that's so cool so thanks chelsea and laura for that i'm actually going to attempt to do my hair with that tonight which could be very risky i've never used a curler before and i've got an hour to get ready tell me why she got me an lol card <laughs> but thanks <laughs> thanks millie and minnie for the card Minnie's the dog. I'm gonna go because like I said, I've got an hour to get ready and it takes me a very long time to get ready. Just ignore any mess in the background and like, this is so messy, I know, but quick outfit of the day. I've just got a black top on Primark, skirts Primark, shoes are new look, and then just got my normal jewelry on, which is Pandora Fendi and my evil eye necklace and a bag. There's also Primark, which I think is so cute. Let's go get very drunk for my birthday. <laughs> Cheers! I said it for stars. Straight for the vlog. Do it for my fans. Yeah, <laughs> 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 back let's ignore how gross i look <laughs> my hair's a right mess but we've got back we've ordered takeaway it's literally only like 10 past 11 but we've ordered food and we're gonna eat this go to bed i'm really tired i have a really bad sore throat becky's really ill but she did well tonight i got hit on by a 15 year old man we went to this random little like local pub that our mate tom goes to and there's like this really old man and he was like I said Becky was single. So his lady friend up to me, she said, you? you're beautiful, are you single? I said, no, I'm a lesbian, I'm a beer. She said, oh. I was ready to swing for some people. <laughs> I'll show you our food now. So we've got cheesy chips, not sure what this pink stuff is, but cheesy chips. Becky got cheesy chips with what sauce is that barbecue? And I also got a chicken tikka wrap. And we're watching Ginny and Georgia. Yum. It's Sunday and I just thought I'd carry on this vlog because I didn't really get as much footage as I'd hoped in this weekly vlog. So obviously last night, the vlog just kind of ended really abruptly because I was so drunk. Like, like I was literally that drunk. As soon as we ate, our heads just hit the pillows and we went to sleep. I didn't even finish my food because I thought I was just going to throw up everywhere. But yeah, we're going to Home Bargains now because I just want to look around. I, I feel like when I don't go in Home Bargains for a while, I like going in to see what's new. Like I haven't been in since Christmas, so I want to go in there. Um, plus I need to get some waters and stuff for work. So yeah. 
come on the day with us. I'm not going to vlog too much today just because this video will be up as I'm filming this today. So I'm just going to do a little bit. My hair is just looking terrible. But I really can't bother to do it. And I've just got my yoga hoodie on again because I barely wore it yesterday. So yeah, let's go shopping. So we're buying a box to put our Christmas decorations. Because it's all just in bags and I don't want them to get ruined. So we've just been well and truly robbed in Home Bargain. So we bought a metal basket, like washing basket, you can see it there. And the label literally said like, 5 dollars so I thought, oh yeah, bargain, let's buy that. Come out, £25 I spent in there, and I thought, how I spent £25 when we literally only bought, like, crisps, mouthwash, dead cheap stuff? It was £15. <laughs> yeah, £15. God's God sake. God <laughs> so yeah, £15 for a basket. We could have got that for £5.99. It's a nice basket, so it's, it's whatever, I'm not going to take it back, but extra £10 than I thought it was. But we bought these mini cheddars that I've not seen. I like trying them when, when mini cheddars bring out like different flavours. I like trying them. This one's cheddar and smoked paprika. Let's try one there. Ooh, it's fun, that. It's nice. Mmm. They are nice. We're going to go to Morrison's now and then go home and I'll show you what we buy. We went to Subway. What name a better hangover cure? I'll give you that in. So we're going to eat this and then I'll show you what we bought from Home Bargains. We didn't buy much, but I'll just show you the few bits that we got. We bought from Subway, which we've both, we've never actually tried them before, but they're these cheese bites and they come with sweet chilli sauce and I'm so excited to try. So let's do a little taste test. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my God, they are so nice. It's a bit spicy, but... If you go to Subway, try the cheese bites. They're literally like one ninety nine. And that's for the sweet chilli sauce with it. Oh my god. Mmm. That's a game changer. <laughs> I just thought I'd quickly show you what I got from Home Bargains. I didn't really get much. Mm, so we saw these. If you know us a flora, then you'll know. But we found the candle. Um, and it smells so strong and clean. And I feel like this would be such like a good kitchen or bathroom scent. And we did this one, a rhubarb one, and then the exotic bloom one. But this was definitely the nicest one. And they were only like £2 or something. But don't be fooled because the picture that we saw of these literally they looked huge, didn't they? Yeah, they looked massive, didn't they? But they're not actually that fragrance, like a normal candle, but still good for like two pounds. And if they burn as well as they smell, then they should be really nice. We got them mini cheddars, which you can see us try. This is the laundry basket that literally rubbed us blind. It's not bad for a laundry basket, but it's just the fact we thought it was like six pounds and it actually turned out to be 16 pounds. But it looks like this, it's just like a wired washing basket. <laughs> There's nothing that exciting of it. I suppose it will go really nice in the house, won't it? But. Yeah. And then we just got a big cardboard box. A big plastic box just for put the Christmas decorations in. I was just in like bags, like bin bags, and I just feel like it's not a very good way of storing them. So we got a box to put up the loft, and then we got just two cooking things. So I got a slow cooker chicken curry because if you've got a slow cooker and you've not tried this, you really need to try it. I use this all the time at work, and it actually tastes really nice. So I just picked up one of them. This is from Morrison. And then we love the Nando's, they're called Bag and Bakes, and we normally get the medium garlic one, but this is a new scent that we've never even heard of or tried, and it's paprika and lime. And it's mild, which is really good, because the garlic one's medium and it's too spicy. This paprika and lime one sounds incredible. Yeah, I'm actually just going to end the vlog here, because, oh my god, I've had that on my face this whole time. Mm -hmm. I've had fluff on my face <laughs> this whole time, so let's just ignore that. But yeah, I'm just going to end the vlog here, because we're literally not doing anything for the rest of the night. We're just going to watch Ginny and Georgie. This cat has been an absolute pain. Yeah, we're going to watch Ginny and Georgia and just chill because we've got work tomorrow. So I hope you enjoyed this week's vlog. It wasn't a very long one just because, like I said, it's hard to vlog on these weeks because I work Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, so that's most of the week gone. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video.